for you leaving Whitehall could not be seen as anything else than a very dark day for the man who now sits before you. Oh, they're so cute. But Come I'm not on. the same man as I was. I've been changed. Come on, honey, run. I'm so fucking nervous dad's gonna walk in. And by the people I've met. Oh boy. Ever since I've had the opportunity. She's, she she cares know. for him. Might be not be love, but, but she cares for him. I have no doubt that you perceive my passions to be sincere. If you allow me to be your protector through life, I swear that I will commit myself to your happiness. Oh, I... he's so. Oh, God. Like, she cares for him, though. This is so awkward. Oh. I beg your pardon. Oh, because she, she cares for him. She does want to hurt his feelings. Fucking run, love. Run. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I feel so sorry for him. I love him. He's my favourite. Anna? Oh, she... Oh, Anna, honey, I want to hug her so bad. She's in such an awkward position. God, the closeness. Oh, God. My anxiety is not doing well recently. That did not help. I hope he wrapped his... Didn't even wrap his body up. Why do you have to bury him? Because you killed him yesterday. And a three-day-old body ain't nothing like a one-day-old body. Any ranger or redcoat who's seen combat will know the difference. It's a good point. He's, they can work well together. Like, he would want to fuck him over. What are you doing? All right. I'm inviting the forest to feast and cover your mistakes. Good idea. I think they're going to be a great team. Why did you come back here? I told you. Fuck I him over. was betrayed. Betrayed by the king. The King of England in London, not by John Andre in New York. And him! Left in what? this war. I mean, I don't see why you just don't run, why you don't just make for the frontier. Huh? He doesn't run. Maybe you should go and get that letter you intend to plant. Go oh, and hurry along, I'll finish digging about it. I'll meet you back at the root zone. Oh! I still need my... Knife. It's my father's, he's noticed it's gone. Uh. It looks nice. Oh, fuck. Oh, Cicero, what are you doing now? He wants to read. Uh, it's quite all right. Don't be afraid. I was... Reading. Peggy Shippen to Miss Rebecca Franks in the care of yours truly. But I thought Philadelphia was in the rebel army now. That letter was delivered through the lines out of the flag of truce. Its contents read and resealed by both sides. I offered to teach your mother to read, but she declined. Let's demonstrate the benefit, shall we? Please. He wants to help with the spy in. I, I had a feeling he knew. The most important news, to be sure, is of my engagement to wed General Benedict Arnold. Following his repeated proposals. Oh, honey. Oh, oh. I like that he's like going, that's not for us to read. Give it to him. She understood the feelings. She was lovely with Peggy too. I was looking for something to send Miss Anna. Uh, we are not spies. There's something I had to do to make you safe. I ain't gonna see you strung up for some business. Don't concern us at all. You understand me? Or oh, you need me to write that down. Shit. Oh, Cicero, he just was. Oh, I, I want to hug him so bad. Oh, honey. When, uh, when is Miss Shippen to be married, sir? As soon as her sister is engaged. It's the only barrier between her and, and Arnold. He knows he put her in that position. He did. 
Could be weeks. Could be months. Could be days. It could be months. She cares for him, she does. I love that. Dear Miss Shippen, I am pleased to hear from Miss Franks of your impending union. Allow me to wish you the greatest joy. Your friends here remark how they hope one day to meet your future husband. Though they well understand the obstacles to such a meeting, they know you are doing everything you can to ensure the brightest future possible. Listen to us, Edward. What can I possibly... What the fuck? Arnold uses his station to line his own pockets at the expense of our interests. Your interests? Yours as well. His reach extends to the... Oh, fuck now. The Continental Army answers to the Continental Congress. If they were to be made aware of his abuse. Oh, fine, oh. yes, you should do that. Me? I was hoping you would be the one we should to speak. Shit, it's gonna fuck up the plan. No, I couldn't possibly. Come out, let them know you've heard. <laughs> fuck, oh, Peggy, honey. I feel so bad for her. Boy, come here. May I ask you to run this letter in through that door? Drop it on the big desk just inside and then run back out. Who's a foe? If you're too frightened, I understand. Ah, uh, play on that. Well, a kiss, of course. You got yourself a deal. <laughs> oh, Peggy, honey. And now she's fucking off, so he can't have the kiss. <laughs> oh, gentlemen. Good God, man. You smell a fright. It's farm work. Hey. Oh, there you are. Well, uh, actually, maybe I should take dinner whilst I'm here. I might not be back until late. Jimmy's not ready yet, but there's pork outside in the smokehouse. Well, that sounds good, yeah. I'll, uh, I'll take a look. Uh, I've only a few more rows left to plant, so... Oh-ho! Oh-ho! It won't be too much longer. Fair play, Mary! Yes, you, uh... Keep your legs together. <laughs> be very careful. Mary, I feel as if... We should open some windows. <laughs> He's... Oh, that's got to be so awkward. They're still there. Rebecca. I can't believe the fact they're still there. Oh, or they put back. Failed to save no, it's our not put back. from being killed in battle. We failed to raise our second as a moral man, and for that I'm... Fail to treat him right, you mean? I don't like him at all. I may not have been able to save Abraham. He's gonna save his grandson, I'm still though. Hoping, young Thomas. You don't you fucking touch Perhaps him. Perhaps the mistakes I made in raising our son can be corrected through his. She own. was so young. I just looked at the dates. Grant me the strength. To do what I must. You do anything to turn that sweet boy against his father. Oh my god, I will jump through that screen. All men are created equal. Hmm, the declaration. I read it, you know. Huh. All men are created equal. Yes, yeah, this time they still have slavery. All those commissioned officers who looked down on me, spat on me, took. Credit from the scalps, cursed me with half pay. <laughs> they saw themselves above me. He is so fucking good. By the justice I deliver to John Andre, that will be my declaration before I leave these colonies. Fair enough. That they were never better than me. Sorry, what was that? <laughs> 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 They're going to make a good team. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Let's move a body. Oh, fuck nuts. What you plant now, you reckon, uh, loose heads? Eh? Oh, aye. When I was a lad, we used to plant uh, cabbages back up in Mantaluna. And if you plant later in the fall, you get this maggots too. You hear that? Run. I like that he told him to run. I like, I'm looking forward to their uh, team up. Oh my god, I'm so looking forward to them. It's Easton. 
very clearly dead. That's a run along the river, no footprints. Oh, I love them together so much. I love that little conversation about the farming too. That's amazing. I must be getting back now. No, 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 stay, stay, please. Shit, fucking run, hide. Go there. God, she gets caught. Check the inventory against the manifest. What are they doing? They're taking it all back. Signed by you. This is a bloody writ of assistance. Do you serve Great Britain now? Do you? For amongst the many charges laying against you, most disturbing is the use of military wagons to offload the charming Nancy, a known smuggling vessel. An action which could be seen as trafficking with the enemy. Fuck. Since those charges are lies, I will assume that you have no evidence to back up the slander that I will see you charged with. What's that? An anonymous letter sent by a concerned patriot led us to your nest of schemes and bad business. Anonymous. Who's it gonna be? Was it? Oh, it was Peggy! It was Peggy's letter. I'll see you there. I hope she changed her handwriting for it, because if you reckon. Oh. Oh my god. Are these things true? No. They are the attacks of an anonymous coward who thinks they can hide behind a disgrace like Reed. Her. This will go away by morning. Fuck. Oh, bollocks. Oh, bollocks. This is gonna be. Oh, whew. Yeah, he needed a bath. He was stinky. <laughs> I'm so looking forward to seeing more of him and um, Robert Rogers. What if her father comes in and sees that? His father, sorry. What if he comes in and sees that? He better not turn Thomas against them. I will be furious. I ask not to be disturbed. I'm afraid I must. Okay. I heard about Corporal Easton. I don't Eat. know how he's done it with his rangers deployed, but Simcoe has somehow managed to strike a double blow against me. I suppose it is the perfect alibi. What do you mean? Perhaps it's for the best that you don't send Abraham to New York anymore. What are you talking about? I'm, I'm talking about my son. I've come here uh, after much deliberation to inform you. No. A traitor against the crown. And that he is... No. Has been for some time. No. A spy for the Continental Army. Oh. Fork. Oh my god, I can't believe he... Oh, I can, but fucking hell. Oh my... Oh no. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. What are they... Oh god, how are they going to hand... Oh no. I don't know how they're going to deal with that. I, I don't know. Oh no. They're fucked. They're absolutely fucked. Shit. Like, if he believes him. Like, how are they gonna. Oh no. I don't know what they're gonna do. Oh fuck. Um, alright, there's other stuff. I'm looking forward to Abe and. Um, Robert Rogers, that's gonna be great. And like, may, if if Abe realizes what his father's just said, maybe him and Roger Rogers can discredit that and make it tr honest. Or oh god, what if he's gonna? Oh fuck! Because like, if he that like that's it, that's Rob Rogers' meal ticket in more ways than one. If he gets discredited, he can't get towards John Andre, so he's gonna have to. 
sort that out, do something. Oh God, and then poor John Andre. Peggy is already discredited in, in um, Benedict Arnold. I kind of felt sorry for him in that moment, but he has changed. He has changed. And Cicero is trying to do spy stuff, but he can't just be out right and do it. But then again, he can use the cover of wanting to learn to read. But he needs to be careful. He can't just outright learn. He's got to be careful. And Abigail wants to protect him. That's why she was okay with him going there. Because one, she wanted to see her son. And two, she wanted to get him away from this, that stuff. Oh, bloody hell. I, I don't know what we're going to do now. That is... Jesus. Because I know, like, premiere episodes always, like, have a big thing. But... Woohoo! Well, that's a bit, that's a my, full on mic shot moment there. That is a fucking hell. Oh, oh no. Oh dear. Oh, fork. Fuck. Shit. <laughs> I'm just gonna, oh, fuck. But yeah, I'm looking forward to so much more Abe and um, Robert Rogers. And then that hanging at the beginning. I, I feel like um, Caleb shouldn't have gone and attacked that guy, but I feel like that guy was involved because the way he was whispering to, is it the colonel? He was a colonel or major, the one that was working with Charles Lake. But he was the way he whispered to him was just, woof. And then, oh my God, the fact that he pushed that guy so hard he got decapitated. Ugh. Oh, that was gross. Sound effect work was great. Oh boy. Oh, I'm so nervous. I am so nervous what's going to happen now. Oh boy, this is going to be a fun one to edit. Oh lordy lordy. Yeah, that was a great episode there. Great, great moments, but oh boy. I'm nervous for the next ep one. Next ep. I was going to say one an episode. It it came out together. I don't know. But the, damn, that was that. Oh boy. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, is all I can say. That's, I, can, that's all, I, I can't go into detail about the other stuff because that's all my head can focus on. Because those shirt balls, they're forked. So I'm trying to, trying to keep into my good place swear words because that's another show I do. But fork. They're forked. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, boy. That's going to be an interesting thing to get around. Which. Jesus. Now I'm thinking, hang on. Does Abe survive to the end of the show? Do not tell me. I do not want to know anything about when anybody passes or gets murdered or anything like that. I do not want to know. But now my head's doubting that Abe's the lead all the way through. But. Because he is the lead, the main character. Because he's in it the most. And it all piv like pivots around him. But now I'm worried. But what if they drop the bomb and boom? Jeez. So much happened in that one. It was fantastic. This show is amazing. It deserved so much more. And I would love to know what you guys thought. But if you enjoyed the reaction, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Give the notification bell a tick. You'll know when the next episode goes live. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you again for the next one. Bye.